This is an ABC 10 News update. Good evening, I'm Kimberly Hunt in the ABC 10 News studio. A dramatic rescue unfolding in the backyard of a home in Hamul. New pictures from the San Diego Humane Society show its emergency response team rescuing a horse from an empty pool after the owner couldn't get him out. The scene unfolded Wednesday on Proctor Valley Lane. The team set up a rescue tripod so they could lift the horse up. They even equipped the horse with a protective helmet. The rescue took three hours and the horse was not injured. On Sunday, two inmates in the San Diego Central Jail were found unresponsive in their cells. Sheriff's deputies took the men to the hospital. One 38-year-old man is now back in jail. The other 33-year-old man died in the hospital. An autopsy is scheduled to determine the cause of death for each man and heightened scrutiny of conditions in San Diego jails uh, after a spike in inmate deaths has been happening in the last few months. San Diego apparently doesn't have the best tacos in the country. The company Clever Real Estate analyzed data from a number of sites to determine the best cities for taco lovers. Austin, Texas topped the list, followed by San Jose, San Antonio, Oklahoma City, and Los Angeles. San Diego ranked number eight. However, San Diego is the number one city for Taco Tuesday, fish tacos, and carnitas lovers. Meteorologist Megan Perry joining us now. Be a good weekend for a fish taco. Oh my, every weekend's a good weekend <laughs> for a fish taco, right? So yes, it is gonna be a nice one, a warm one for our first weekend of fall. We'll actually see 80s for most of the county because that also goes for some of the warmer coastal areas and the hotter inland spots are going to be in the 90s. Temperatures five to 15 degrees above average Saturday through Wednesday.